there's four games really, international games in this warm-up. The first two really were only about performance. And, you know, by and large, it was a, a decent performance over the two games. But from now on, the get-out-of-jail free card is gone. This is all about winning. Big game now on Saturday against France. You know, France are coming over. have only two games now in this warm-up, so it's a very, very big game for France. So it's a, it's a really, it's a must-win from Ireland's point of view. England in the following week, so there's no, problem, there's no problem with losing the last two, but it's about winning these next two now going forward. If you're looking at it from a management point of view, I'd say they're pretty happy. They're looking at it that they've managed to get all the way through here without any serious injuries. And they have a massive amount of players who've come back from injury and are now available again. The Ferris, Jordan Murphys, Brian O'Driscoll, Gordon Darcy, all these guys now are available again. So the mission for them will be start getting the win, better performances, and keep these guys on the pitch. Don't hopefully get the fingers crossed, don't let any major injuries happen. The French will obviously have a go at targeting the Ireland in the type five, so that's vital. Other than that, you have to fancy that Ireland are going to do it. I mean, this French team's only been cobbled together. Uh, I suppose a lot of them haven't played together. They're only having two matches. I think uh, Levermont's, what, made 13 changes. So it's a new look French side. So I would expect that Ireland uh, are probably going to deliver that win they, they, they need this weekend. I'm looking forward to seeing Ireland to see how they'll start, get a few points on the board, you know, develop a few combinations. That will then give Dick and Kidney a chance to bring on some of the other players, have a look at them. French team expects a strong, strong uh, Irish side with uh, Brian Zisco will come back and uh, Gordon Darcy and also uh, all the front row and um, and uh, and the captain, Irish captain. Then uh, I think that will be a great game and a tough game for France uh, on Saturday. But who knows, hopefully France were going to win. The French have a massive player pool. And they're still, as you say, in deciding on who they want to bring, who they're not. So it's still a very, very strong side. Ireland know what they have to do. They have to start the game strong. That's the one thing we, we haven't done over in France in a long time, is start the game very well. So we have them back at home. We've beaten them here several times. And we have to continue on from there. And I have to start the game well, and hopefully we've been a bit lacking, I think, in the centre partnerships. But the O'Driscoll and Darcy partnership back there again, hopefully start getting some tries on the board and the game improves. So I would be disappointed if we don't get a win.